yourself together, man. Come on, let's get into my car. <laughs> What do you know about this? Well, it, 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 it's hard to say. But I've got a sort of idea that when... Idea? In this country, we don't like ideas. We like facts. How long is it you have been in this country? Well, about six months, but I... Not I, long, eh? I don't see what that has to do with it. You have been taken on here as manager. Assistant. Hired, necessary, fired by me. Living in this house? Uh, no, in the store. Just over the other side of the hill. Master, I hope you realize the unpleasantness of this case. When you've been in this country long enough, we understand we don't like Kaffir's murdering white woman. But we don't know who did it, do we? Oh, she really ought to get married. No, she's not a bad sort, Mary. She'd make a good wife for somebody. The only trouble is, right, she's getting on a bit. Yes, but there's something missing. She just won't take the plunge. Come on, there's nothing to plunge into, you mean. Okay, say that again. <laughs>
Go away, Janet, please. But there's no one to see you. I've had a busy day. Who? Yeah. Water problems. Water's the big headache all over my area. Mm. Slows everything down. Yeah. Damn nuisance. Look, I'm not beating around the bush with you, Mary. If we're going to get on, we've got to be straight with each other, don't you think? Yes. What I mean is... It's a hell of a... Please, you are there. Fine, fine. Thank you. I keep thinking about you, you know. Yeah. You a city girl and all. I always thought it would be unfair, really. I mean, it would be... It would be a sacrifice for anybody, you know what I mean? I think so. Your steak's all right? Yes. Have some more. No. Yes. Out there you have to... Uh, love the soil. Like me. Look, Dick. Tell me what you want to say. Don't think I won't understand. I want... I want to marry you. Yes. You mean? Yes, I'll marry you, Dick. Is everything to your satisfaction, sir? Yes, thank you. Thank you, madam. Mary? Thank you. Hang on, I'll get the torch.
Welcome. Come in. I'll light the lamp in a second. Cutting in Germany. Bo, cutting Abon Ubaba. Why cut us to Angamaki was he believed? No, please. The boys upset me. Plenty of houseboys, Mary. You're getting yourself into a state, Mary. Why don't you take over the farm accounts? You're always on about how wonderful your office job was in town. Okay, Parson. Okay? It's, it's all right, Bus. He scrubbed that bath all day. Didn't even let him go for lunch. Well, he could do something. He can do something instead of pottering around the house all day, taking advantage. He's a human being, after all. It's my house. Don't interfere. How you let things get so filthy, I cannot understand. It's not filthy. There's minerals in the water. That's what makes the bath go that color. Good, healthy minerals. Now, listen to me. I work hard enough, don't I? All day long, I'm down on the lands with these lazy black savages, fighting them to get some work out of them. I won't come home to this, this fight, fight, fight in my house. You expect a lot from me, don't you? You expect me to live like a poor white in this poky little place of yours. Every single day, I have to suffer this killing heat because you won't save up enough to put I it I told you, I told you what to expect. I told you when I married you. <laughs> Ceilings. You can whistle for them. I've lived in this house for six years and it hasn't hurt me. But you're so posh. Bah! A tiny city girl, scared as hell of my bugs and dust. Of campus, even. And that boy will stay now. I've seen to that. Now treat him properly and don't make a fool of yourself again.
dismissing you. Leave that. Here's your money. Take your money and go. It's not me you're hurting. It's yourself. I've never had trouble with my boys. You want to kick them in the backside all day, like Charlie. What does that do? What does it do? Charlie's made a fortune, that's what. This water is going very quickly. What are you doing with it? Just washing. You're having six baths a day. No. Well, then I don't understand where it's all going. I pour it over myself. What? Wasting it like that? I'm so hot, I can't stand it. Listen to me. Listen to me. Every time I order the water cart, it means a driver and two boys off work for a whole morning. And you throw it away. Why don't you fill the bath and get into it when you get so hot? I'm sorry, Mary. I've had a terrible day. Don't be angry with me, please. Do you hate me for bringing you here? 
Listen to me sometimes. What do you mean? Well, it's your accounts. They cannot be balanced. Yeah, and I'm so grateful to you for sorting them out, Mary. You know that. Listen to me. They cannot be balanced. Those ventures of yours, the bees, the turkeys, they incur debts that the small crops cannot pay off. There'll be some profit. Don't worry. But I've been pinning my hopes on some sort of change. You look after the accounts like a good girl. Leave the farming to me. Sorry, Mary, but you must remember the old house rule. No married women. Oh, I see.
you take the school, please? I'm sorry, you think I didn't buy any particular night. You should be lucky. This way, madam. This way, madam. She's a good secretary. Uh, not as good as you were, but... But I... Can't just tell her to toddle off like that. Mary, have you been ill? Look, why don't we have some lunch together? I've got nothing on here to stop me. Mary, my dear. Okay. What should I do? Take Charlie's advice. Plant one big crop. Like what, for example? Like tobacco. <laughs> you need barns for tobacco. You don't just pluck it out of the earth and sell it, you know. Where's the money coming for that? I'd like to know. Charlie, Charlie, Charlie. I'm not bloody Charlie Muller. Perhaps Charlie can give you space in his barns. <laughs> you think he's got room in his barns for my tobacco? He's hardly got room for his own. But you know nothing. I know nothing. You were the one who thought African bees would swarm to English beehives. South Africans would suddenly start eating rabbits. All those rabbits you raised. I want you to plant maize. Not one or two worthless acres again. A big, big crop. And if the rains fail, what then? I don't know, but everything's so hopeless. Every year you'll say, next year again. And I get a good crop, Mary. Stop it, Mary. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dick. I can't. I just can't bear it anymore. It's all right, Mary. Okay, boss. We'll do magic. A big crop, like you say. We'll need all my kaffirs. We'll need to get more, but uh, we'll do it, I promise. I'll uh, back it up with something else, uh, something simple, just in case. 
Uh, Kappa Storm, perhaps. But, uh, like you say, we need a break. We need a biggie. Keep giving it to him now. Keep him warm. Plenty of liquids. You must get some ceilings in here. Or he'll have a heat stroke on top of malaria. You don't look well, Mrs. Turner. You run down in anemic. You're to take these. As soon as your husband recovers, take a holiday. Go to the coast or something. I've never been to the coast. And get some gauze on the windows to keep the mosquitoes out. Then there's less chance of catching malaria. Mary, you must keep an eye on the farm. Don't you agree? Yeah. One minute. You know the rule. I make that. 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 One minute. Then back to work. I make that. You get back to work. Get back. Mm. 
Nana Lumfazi and Sanya. Speak gibberish to me. I want water. You <laughs> And you dare speak to me like that? All right. Get back to work. All of you. Mary. How they stink. That animal smell. They're calling you names. You know how hard it is to find labor. I didn't sack them, they left. Why, I wonder. Thank God I'm nearly better. Enough food for the whole compound tonight, eh? Very good bath. Okay, okay, back to work. They'll have a lot to do. Some bit. Back. Cut 
off that first acre, okay, Moses? Okay. Yeah. 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 Morning, madam. Yesterday I start as houseboy. Master Tanner asked me.
schlägt hier so ein. Der Hü. Floor. I scrubbed it this morning. Do it. Scrub it at once. I do for you. Mm. Just came to see how you're doing. You're not well, Tony. Just the blood thinning after all these years. Oh. Old lady looking after you? Yeah. yeah how is she? Fine. Leave. Lean, I'm worried sick about her. What's that trouble, man? I don't know. But well, can we help? No. Well, maybe... How about buying my truck? Better truck? Yeah. How much you want for it? Whatever. A hundred. A hundred? Okay, it's a deal. I'll send over the cash later. Turn up. Turn up, listen to me, man. Everything's going wrong for you. You give all this up. You need a change. Look, I'll give you a good deal for this farm. Are you crazy? I need the grazing. You need the break. Let's face it, man. It's not working out for you yet. Grazing? This is my bloody farm, man. I built it for nothing. Now, wait a minute. Now, take Hold my on. truck and leave me alone. You sell, wait and see. I want to go. Where, well, Moses? Away.
Here, drink. Go and lie down. Madam, lie down. What is it, Mary? Hey. I don't think house was. Should. I bring from the compound. It is good milk. Madam sleep last night? I must look. What do you mean? Um. Madam sleep now. I'll stay with Master Turner. 
let them think I'm not able to look after Master Ten. I also get sick, you know. Go there, sleep. If Master Tenna gets bad, I'll call Madam. Is Madam afraid of me? Does Madam think Jesus was a white man? Tell me. Does Jesus think that it right white people treat black people the way they do? Jesus for good people. And good people must all be white in this country. Is this true? Answer me. I hate this house. Then why madam come? Long time since I came here. I should have left long ago. I don't know why I didn't. I don't know why I came. Moses. Moses. I think Master Tanner is better now. Turner. Nice evening. Yeah. Nice. Rains are late. I'm uh, worried about my tobacco. I haven't got enough bonds. Anyway, how's the store going? It isn't. Packed it up? I'm using up the stock. What did you come for? Nothing. Uh, I can't stay long. You never come for nothing. Well, I'm just going to say how you're getting on, Turner. We know you've been sick again. What? <laughs> It's that nice 
Mr. Muller. Mary, what are you doing? We haven't had the pleasure for a long time. Go back to your room. Why, I was saying to Dick, Mr. Muller, oh dear, Mr. Muller, you'll stay to supper, won't you? Moses! Moses, we have a guest. For dinner. Oh, well, I can't remember everything. What have we? Oh, okay. She's not too well. I think you'd better go. Yeah. Uh, I just want to say something about your farm, Tony. What about it? Well, it's all arranged. A drink? A drink, dear Mr. Muller. Charlie's got to go now. Oh. We put in lovely food. Oh, come, come. Dear Mr. Muller. Well, uh, I thought you were going. Whatever you like to drink. Got some gin? Oh, yes. Thank you, Moses. I wish the rains would come. Don't you, Mr. Muller? Moses, would you mind bringing the tomato sauce? I think Mr. Muller would like some tomato sauce. No. Oh, my. It does look good. You're so clever, Moses. I'm not selling if that's what you've come about. I'm keeping my end up. Mm. Some salt and pepper, dear Mr. Muller. Stop calling me dear mister. We'll, we'll talk about that later. Oh, thank you, Moses. Dick ordered me to keep him, because... That's enough, Mary! He knew. Keep quiet! You're not eating. No. What's going on here? Mrs. Tanner's not well. Where are you from, boy? Are you talking to me? Get out of here! Get out! Come outside. I want to talk to you. Get some air. There's this fellow pelting mouse tonight, Doc. Greenhorn, just out from England. A dead keen to learn. Now listen, man. He's working for me, but you can manage this place. And you can take a break.
Ah, morning. I've prepared madam's dress for holiday. Put it on, Moses. I do not think Madame goes on holiday. The seaside. I think Madame live forever. Forever. And... Brush my hair, Moses. That's nice, Moses. You do it so... Why did you come here? I'm managing this farm now. Why did you bring this boy? Isn't there another boy? He's to be fired anyway. M Mr. Muller says so. I do not work for Mr. Muller. Is Madam living this farm? Yes. Going away. He will never come back. Going away. Does Madam want me to go? He won't go away. He can't. He can't. Take it easy. Take it easy. Get out. Does Madam want me to go because of this white man? Go away. Help me. Get out. Musa Ukohamba Moses. Musa Ukohamba Moses. 